I think as a researcher, you really have to pick the area, you know, you really convinced you know, it is going to be important in the future. So uh, there's sort of a couple of uh, the pieces of work that I've done, uh, some which other people consider important and others which I consider important myself. It's a big complex system where everyone is a teeny piece of it and they selfishly try to do something good for themselves and hopefully the whole economy works well. The Technical Achievement Award represents the technical contributions by our members over the last 10 to 15 years. So over the years, uh, of course, there were a few uh, achievements, some which were probably more important than others. Um, so if I were to focus on the last 15 years of my career, um, there are a couple of things which other people thought uh, were important. Uh, one of them was the um, what's called the probabilistic key predistribution scheme for large sensor networks. So um, in this area, one of the things I showed was one of my uh, graduate students uh, that you can uh, distribute encryption keys um, in such a way in a large sensor network that uh, the network becomes expandable uh, with minimum effort. You could add and, and delete nodes. And uh, the number of keys that were stored per sensor um, was actually very, very small. So uh, the interesting thing about the scheme is that it led to a uh, key graph, uh, which turned out to be very similar to a random key graph and all of a sudden that random key graph uh, was picked up by people in other fields uh, such as discrete mathematics. Theory community, the computer science theory community has been thinking about the effect of selfishness and the interface of economics and computer science has been a very active and very successful area in, um, at, in theory, that is in the theoretical part of computer science What's really, really special about this award that it's coming from a much broader community and we strongly believe that the, this interface is very important and understanding the effect of selfishness is not only Im important for theoreticians but it's important for the broader computer science community. Uh, and the recognition, I, I view in this award the recognition that the whole computer science community recognizes how important this interface is. The Technical Achievement Awards this year are particularly interesting in that they cover very relevant topics to today's computer science and the industry itself. I met a very good advisor who um, um, advised me on my final year project and that turns out to be a research-oriented project and eventually it actually led to a publication in an IEEE conference and that, that was my first paper. And, um, and that sort of gave me my confidence. It is always an honor to win an award, and um, uh, more so when it is an IEEE CS Technical Achievement Award. Um, I'm both honored and humbled um, to be um, listed among past winners who have been very successful in their careers. Um, I think this is also uh, an encouragement to me and my colleagues, who my collaborators, including my colleagues, my students, and um, I think I can tell my student that if they work hard, you know, um, eventually um, what they do could be recognized by the um, research community and um, professional societies. My research over the last 15 years uh, really led to this award, and it all evolves about around privacy, how can we protect our personal data when communicating over the internet, using the internet? So for instance, uh, imagine you have to authenticate somewhere, uh, like a teenage chat room for instance, and uh, we want to protect the teenagers. And so <clears throat> in order to do that, uh, if it just wouldn't have any authentication, then like everybody could go in there, uh, everybody else, also the teenagers. And 
so in order to protect the teenagers, you want to make sure that only people who are like, between 12 and 18 or so can log in. And so you could, for instance, use electronic identity cards, issue them to, to them. But then if you were to do this with traditional, traditional technology, then they would be fully identified and some things uh, it would make it much worse because then all their data would be on the servers and uh, if the servers get hacked and their address, whatever, uh, gets revealed as well. And so with the, the work that we did over the past 15 years, uh, we can authenticate teenagers just as teenagers. They would just reveal that they are having an ID card, that they are between 12 and 18, but no other information. So uh, as I said, I started to look at uh, this, uh, uh, how to manage data uh, like t uh, 20 or 30 years ago. But at that time, uh, the issue is more just, just scalability. When the data volume increase rapidly, how do you really catch up to, uh, to manage and derive value out of the data? But, uh, but, but later on, no, oh, the, the thing become more complicated right? because we are having a different type of data. Uh, with, with the availability of the web, we have this tax data, and then with social network become available, then we have this, uh, uh, this network data. And then uh, when this uh, uh, cell phone GPS type of thing become available, then we have trajectory data. So we have all type of data. <laughs> Computer Society Awards are presented by peers of the individuals who receive these awards. It's one of the most significant awards that the society gives because it represents the vitality of the research and contributions that our members are, are doing. Of course, I was very happy to, to receive the award, um, and particularly since uh, I received it in very good company. The other uh, four awardees are very prominent people in their own fields. So I'm uh, exceptionally uh, pleased to be in that company. Many of us are in a lucky position that we, have, we can work on things that we really like and enjoy, sing, enjoy what we work on every day, find it fascinating, intellectually interesting, and that's a really, really nice position to be in. I'm very honored to receive this uh, award, uh, very gratifying. Uh, also, I mean, it's not just I getting an award, I mean, yeah, I'm really receiving the, uh, 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 representing the, all the co collaboration work with all my co-workers. Computer science is a um, very um, active area. Um, very often our, you know, before we, whatever we can think of, probably other re researchers would have thought of it as well. And, and, and so you just have to work fast, um, work smart, and, um, and hopefully, um, they'll be rewarded for their effort.